big team battle pvp fighting starts today and everything you need to know to get yourself prepared for it if you play enough games in the flight you can actually earn an in-game emblem for the release of the game a chance for you to also earn the ice unicorn emblem at launch and the long-awaited rockstar energy drink promotion that can give you up to 60 hours of double xp but do you want to know more well stay tuned throughout the whole video to understand all the details <laughs> So the flight is finally gone live for us guys. I streamed it last night, just played a bunch of bots and training modes because obviously we don't have PvP right now, but by the time you're watching this video, PvP has gone live and will continue to be live this entire weekend. So in this video, I wanna give you some information about what to expect for Halo Infinite's flighting this weekend. Wait for you to earn some in-game content during this flight as well. And how to grind through your progression two times faster for 60 hours in Halo Infinite to get those unlocks. So if you guys like these news and informational videos and want to see more like this, make sure to tap that like button as it really does help out the video and channel get a better place within the YouTube algorithm. And if you want to stay up to date with everything going on with Halo as it ramp up to the release of Halo Infinite, well make sure you tap subscribe. Let's get right into the content here. So let's go into the big news today. PvP flying starts today and there's actually been a schedule change as well if you guys don't remember. I've been talking a lot about the schedule for the whole week that you guys prepared for. Well, there's been a change to it recently. I talked about it in a previous video, but just so we're all on the same page here, that each play session still has the same time frame of 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. and 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. But previously, 343 was staggering out the game modes where the first day would be Capture Flag, second the day would be Total Control, third day would be Slayer. Now, each day of the flight has all three modes being played on fragmentation so you better believe i'll show you guys what total control is like on this channel so make sure you subscribe to keep yourself up to date now can i put my uh tin foil hat on here because i think there's a little bit of a surprise we might get this weekend because as you can see it's the same three modes on the same one map the entire weekend it can get a bit repetitive and maybe you see a lot of drop off when it comes to player retention I think 343 has a little bit of a surprise up their sleeve. In the September release of Inside Infinite, there was a little bit of a screenshot that we've never seen before. And it's this screenshot right here. And if you look at it, this is from a BTB map. As it says right here, a Spartan flees with opposing team's flag in a round of big team battle. The only BTB map we've seen is Fragmentation. And this section right here, it's definitely not from Fragmentation. I believe if 343 is going to show this unnamed map, that it's probably one of the maps that's most likely ready to go next when it comes to BTB maps. And so my tinfoil hat theory is that we could have another behemoth situation where we could see this map come in on Sunday. Again, this is my total conspiracy theory tin hat idea right here. But if anything does come around, I guarantee I'll let you guys know on this channel. And talking about playing BTB this weekend, there is a way for you to earn this emblem for the in-game release of Halo Infinite. Where if you play 10 matches within this weekend's Halo Infinite technical preview, the Soul Testing Grounds emblem will be yours once Infinite releases. Which I'll say it's like not the craziest looking emblem or anything like that. I mean, it doesn't really scream like I played Halo Infinite early, like the kind of Halo Insider nameplate does for MCC. But hey, there's a way for you to earn some in-game content already by just playing the game. So jump in and do that. And there's another way for you to earn some more in-game content where today at 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 343 is going live with a community play date for the Halo Infinite flight. And it gives you a chance to earn the Ice Unicorn Emblem at launch. So this is the first time we've heard that the traditional payout for the emblem that you receive when playing against the community on these play dates, it's actually coming, coming back in Halo Infinite. So that's a chance for you to earn that as well. So you can double down, get your games in, match against 343, get your Ice Unicorn as well. So you already have a chance to flex on these people when the game actually releases this fall. This next section here is a long awaited promotion that we've been kind of going like, hey, where is it at? It's been quite a few months since the first time we saw this leak out. That was the Rockstar promotion, but this Rockstar promotion gives you a chance to earn up to 60 hours of double xp and in-game content as well so these are going to be some things you're going to want to pick up the first time we saw this can leak out was actually back on may 26 where we actually saw this can pop up saying my buddy found this at a gas station <laughs> this new rockstar promotion right rockstar and halo infinite and we've been i've been keeping an eye on them man i want to know what is this promotion all about because there's a qr code for you to scan right there there's some limited editions collect you can collect a whole set there's also says there's in-game content right here but we didn't know until finally today where the promotion has gone live so here is the landing page for the rockstar promotion essentially the way the whole thing is going to work is that there's going to be a code that's going to be underneath the tab of each rockstar energy drink you type in that code right there it gives you some in-game unlocks and things like that 
What kind of unlocks, you ask? Well, let's check it out. Well, one, it gives you double XP per coast. So that's 30 minutes of double XP, so you can grind through your battle pass and get your unlocks faster within Halo Infinite. And they have some codings in here, which actually look pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not trying to fanboy here or be like, oh my God, Rocks are so great. But like, literally these codings look really cool. <laughs> so I zoomed in and hopefully you guys can see it a little better. There's the assault rifle skin and like it's like gold and black like dude that looks honestly looks really sick not gonna lie you have one for the warthog as well you have an emblem you can earn with like the gravity hammer on it you also have a razorback coating you can put on there as well and various other stores like circle k and amazon will give you more challenge swaps as well now there is a little bit of a catch with this so you have to be 18 years of age to be able to participate in this obviously you can probably just fake your numbers like everyone does on the internet but if you want to stay true to yourself and make sure you don't lie to the people on the internet that you had to be 18 years or older to participate within this promotion so you can see the way it works out where like one code will earn you two challenge swaps and some double xp double xp comes in 30 minute increments and so then each code gives you 30 minutes of double xp the second one gives you the assault rifle the fourth one gives you the warhog the sixth one gives you your emblems and then you can go all the way up to 120 codes which 120 codes equates to 60 hours of double xp and probably diabetes if you have that many rock stars at once here's a promotion for all you canadian players out there as well again all you gotta do is just grab a rock star type that code that's underneath the tab right there and you have your chance to earn some of these awesome rewards. So if you guys are new to the channel or missing any content from me recently, here's a link to all my videos right here in the playlist for all my Halo Infinite news we've been uploading daily about. Thank you so much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out.